Hello and welcome. Today we are talking about selling on eBay. Now you may be wondering why exactly we're talking about that on this channel. And the reason is sometimes when you are an online seller, you have dry periods, times when things are not selling. So I'm going to delve into selling on eBay a little bit in this video. Here I have a pile of stuff and additionally I have a bunch of other stuff that I saved up from my spring cleaning. So I'm going to list that and then kind of let you know how much all of the items end up selling for in total at the end. So over here behind me I've set up a little photo booth. Uh, this is nothing more than a couple of poster boards on, this is a trifold poster board and one at the bottom is just a plain white poster board and I've set it next to a window where I can get some good natural lighting and that way I can set my items on here and take some photographs and I'm actually just going to use my phone in this instance. I'm going to show you how I do one of my listings. First I turn on my phone and then I use, I'm using the eBay app and then I type on, let's see here, the search bar and I search for what I am looking for, which in this case is producing your own power. Press search. And then I like to go under filter, completed items, and press done. And find one that sold. So when I found one I, it, that sold, I tap on it and I can press sell one like this. And it copies everything over but the photographs. So I can go photos and add photos. Press the little photo button. Take a new photo. And then I can take my own photograph. And press OK and then upload. When I am listing the item I can also tap on one of the, I can tap on any of these and change it, the photos, the title, uh, the condition, etc. And if I tap on description I can tap here and I can press the little microphone button and I can just start recording my description of this item. This is a producing your own power book period. The desk cover is missing, period. The book is very clean, period. A few pages in the center are coming a bit loose from the binding though, period. Overall, this is an excellent book, period. Good morning and welcome to day two. It has been less than 24 hours total and I have made my first sale. It was five dollars, I sold a book, and uh, they notified me right here on my phone uh, with eBay. And so I had a total of 31 listings put up yesterday. So now I still have 30 active listings and I've got my booth set up here again. I'm trying to avoid the direct sunlight, that's why it's turned a different direction. And I have even more list stuff to list, so I'm gonna get to it. little update for you. I had a few more sales. I had a little curriculum here for Hooked on Phonics Pre-K, also a toy that sold, and a book. So I'm going to get these ready to ship out and I'm waiting payment for one other item and when that comes in I'll get it shipped as well. So I finally got around to finishing up this video. I started filming it in August and now it's October and I was just kind of letting my listings finish out and see where they went before I added anything new because I wanted to see what my grand total was. So my grand total for 23 items sold was $774.27 and this includes any money that people paid for the shipping price as well. But my top five best sellers happen to be uh, the first one was New York State Building Code Book. I sold for $150. My second runner-up was a Zoophonics Curriculum for $130. Mm, my third runner-up was Outdoor Venture Core Tent from the 70s that I sold for $50 and the poles were missing, otherwise it would have been worth about $100. I also sold Your Baby Can Read for $33. I sold some scrap leather and tools for $28 as a lot. 
and also a pair of my leather boots for 30 bucks. So overall I felt that it went pretty well. I made several hundred extra dollars that I was actually, I went and applied towards buying my kids homeschool curriculum for this year. And so it is a great way to make some extra money. Uh, this eBay is one of the first places that Roy and I started selling as online sellers. And so we had quite a bit of experience there. Uh, we sold hundreds if not thousands of items on eBay within a year's time before we kind of trans transitioned us into some other things. So if you're interested in giving eBay a try, I did write an ebook for you for $3 and it's called 30 Tips for Making Money on eBay, which of course is available at our website www.blacksmithpdfs.com and it delves into some things that would help you to make money there as well. Some of the things that we implemented during our time making money on eBay and even we did it when Roy was even working HVAC and uh, it brought in some extra income, about $1,000 a month, um, if not a little more. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this vlog and I'd love to hear down in the comments if you've tried selling anything on eBay. So let me know and I will catch you on the next one. Bye bye.